Hi friend, this is Pastor Lucas Pina, and this is our snack for the journey. And we are in a journey in the book of Psalms, so I'd like to invite you to join us in this journey. My goal is to have a meditation in every psalm in the Bible. And it's one or two verses for each psalm, it's not the whole psalm. And maybe in the future we will be back on this, in the psalms and, and, and revisit all the psalms. All the, there is so many, so many of them. Great, beautiful great lessons for all of us. So I'd like to invite you to join us. And not only that, I'd like to invite you and to encourage you to subscribe to our channel and to share this video with your friends and family and help us to bless other people. So let's take a look in the meditation for today. The, the psalm for today is Psalm 71 verse 18. 71 verse 18. Look what the psalm is uh, uh, wrote and sang and prayed. He said, even when I am old and gray, do not forsake me, O God, till I declare your power to the next generation, your might to all who are to come. It's, it's just one psalm, and, but it's with so many less. It's, it's very hard for us to unpack the whole thing here. They, the, the psalmist here is, is telling that, uh, that the Lord, since the youth, the Lord is, is with him and then said, Lord, I'd like to you to continue. Even when I'm old, I'd like you to continue to be with me because I still have work to do. That is the point here. You have been with me since my youth. You have blessed me. You are walking with me. You have saved me. You are, you are doing all those things. And I'm grateful for that. And I, but I want you to be with me all the way to the end. Not only that. It's very important for us to understand what the psalmist is asking here. He said, until I declare, I want to keep telling people about you, your power to the next generation. Friends, we, there's, there's something, there's some limitations that we, we, we don't have control over, right? We, we cannot predict the future, what's going to be in three, four, five generations. The psalmist is not thinking that down the road, that, that far down the road. No, he say, look, I just want to tell about your power, about your grace, about your mercy, about your works to the next generation. And then the next generation will tell, will tell the other generation. For those who are to come. So the psalmist is, is, is asking the Lord to continue to bless him since he is blessing him, the, since the, the youth Said, hey, even when I'm old, I, I want you to not forsake me. Hang in there. Stay with me. Help me. So I can tell the next generation. That's the goal. It's not just to bless us, to strengthen us, to help us, to give us health or, or financial uh, uh, support. No. I want you to stay with me to walk with me, to bless me, so I can tell the next generation. That's our goal, my friend. No matter how old you are, and if you are like me, kind of, not a lot of hair, gray hair, white, most of them, it's, we want the Lord to stay with us all the way to the end. That's the goal. But that is not, it's just part of the goal. The other part of the goal is so we can tell about His power, the power of God, to the next generation. We have a work to do. No matter how old we are, we have a work to do to tell the next generation about the power of God and how gracious and good He is. Join me and let's do that. And this is our snack for today. God bless you.